Hi guys. I have $93 today that I'll be working with. This will be my third time stuffing these. And like I said, you can try to do it daily. You can try to do it weekly, bi-weekly, or just whenever you come into some extra cash. And I have some extra cash from a printing job that I did for someone. And so that's what I'm going to stuff today in our Twisted Challenge. I already decided since I'm behind on my dollar, I call it my old snap dollar challenge because of course I'm adding a twist to it as well, that I'm going to stuff my third envelope in it. So it will be getting $33 out of the $93. That's 20, 30, one, two, and three. So that will complete this envelope. It gets $3 plus 30. And if you're interested in knowing how I'm doing this challenge, just, you know, you could just ask me. You could email me. I don't mind sharing it with you. For my uh, remaining challenges, you know I'm doing two twisted penny challenges and two dollar twisted challenges. And since I have um, $60 left, on each challenge, I think I'm going to give $15 to. To do whatever nine two three four five ten fifteen five ten fifteen let's do it that way give that fifteen and that fifteen so each challenge will receive fifteen dollars i'll try to use it up as much as i possibly can see how many pennies i can color off in dollars i can color off and if i have anything remaining that won't fit into the challenge i'm gonna put that into my youtube envelope so I'm going to do something with the dollars I um, accumulate in that envelope later. But if I have anything left, then I'll, it'll go in that envelope. So let's jump right into this first one. Let me take my penny out. How are you guys coming with your twisted challenges? I hope you're doing just great. Y'all, I got me a pistachio latte, hot pistachio latte with extra whipped cream. Woo, 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 woo. I love it. I love it. I love it. I have to stay away from them. I'm sure it's adding calories that I don't need to add, but it's good. I like it. All right. So I have $15 and this challenge don't have a $15 on it. It only has, um, I see right away, I can use this and I can color up. Oh, I can color up a bunch of boxes. Let me see. So if I do 10 in this one, that's one. Uh-oh. That's one. It's going in a... So 10 is one, one. I'm not going to color these on film. I'm just going to roll it in. And then since I have $5, I can put in a dollar each. I can put in $5. So one, two, three, four, five. And I'll color in five more pennies. One, two. And again, I'm sorry for all those that think I need to go in line when I do this. One, two, three, four, five. And that would be my dollars that's gonna go into here. So $15 goes into A. A, 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 and A. Okay, so I didn't have any left over from that challenge, but you know what? I think I'm supposed to have more pennies because for each circle, I'm supposed to have more pennies and dropped in there. So I'm gonna have to check that and make sure I got enough pennies in there. And for this challenge, I also have $15 and you know, I can probably just do the same thing, right? I can drop in the $10, then I'll have one, two, three, four, five dollars remaining that I can circle in. 
So I'm gonna circle in this one for the $10, this one for $1, Two, three, four, and five. Now remember, I have two sheets of these to complete. So don't think, man, she's almost finished with hers because I have another whole sheet because I'm doing two separate penny challenges. So I had to do two separate sheets. So I'm counting these in and these will all go to B. B, 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 and B. And I'll color those in later. Let me drop this in. And also, I'm going to have to do likewise and count my pennies because I got to make sure each penny is accounted for. All right, so that's that one. Now, let's work on this one. All right, we're going to go by dollar here. So let's see. This one uses the city method. I pull out a dollar. All right, it was, it's L and that is San Francisco. So San Francisco, I could either do $9, $18 or $50. Well, I have $15. So I can put in this 10 and get a dollar back. I have a dollar. Get the dollar back and that'll be $6 that will go into my YouTube envelope. So I can only color in one dollar bill for that one. All right, for the next one, let's see what letter will be on the dollar. And I got $15 for it as well. E is on this dollar and it's it goes by alphabet. So E is the fifth letter of the alphabet. I gotta put in $5 and the dollar. So that's one dollar I can color in. Yay. I got $10 left, so let me pull another dollar. <laughs> it's E too. E. So $5 will go in here with the dollar. I get $5 back and I can color in another dollar and oh my gosh did i get a stack of e's e <laughs> it's for this one so i can color in another dollar and put that last five in there and color in another dollar all right, and I was about to say, no, my next letter is K. So I was about to say, did she give me a stack of E's? That's no fun. So nothing is left from this challenge. So I won't have anything to stuff, but $6 into my YouTube envelope. And I still have the $4 in there from another stuffing that I did, but it'll all add up in the end and I'll let you guys know where I'm putting it. So for now, that's it for this challenge. And I hope you guys are having a great day, night, whatever time it is, wherever you are. Until then, try a pistachio latte hot. I haven't tried the cold one, but it may be just as good, I don't know. Anywho, see you guys later, enjoy yourself. Bye-bye.